the country needed to connect 100 million is hopefully 50 million are talking to labor 50 million. So how many uh, operators do you see who are needed to support you know, 50 million connections? 50 million. 50 million, of course. 50 million. Very good. Note that that implies that for the population size, half the people, half the country had to be operators to connect the other half. Right. Which is, you know, impossible. Right? You can't have half the people and the operators from the rest of the world. So the idea of automation got then this is in the nineteen tens and they started making these electronic cross bar switching systems. And that's what all it means is that whatever the mechanically was being done by the operator was now done electronic. So you see old exchange pictures where there's like a mesh, right? And they automatically the the, the switches connect any call party to a uh, to a calling part of So those are connections. And initially started off with what they used to call crossbars and so on. Then it becomes relays, mechanical. <coughs> then it became vacuum tube based switches in the maybe 50s or so. Then the transistor came around. So you can see the technology growth. Fundamentals in change. The only fundamental change was automating the, uh, the operators. And then in the uh, in the uh, 60s, then ICs started coming in and on and on. So you can see the technology growth, but the basic. Copper connection did not change as an axis. 